Orale, Cholo Truck, los tres chingones, boxing shots, all the chingones y chingonas. And it was a little bit of a slow weekend in boxing, but there was some boxing going on. Yes, I know there was a fight out in uh, Japan early this morning or Tuesday morning, depending on when you guys are watching this. And I did get a chance to see that. That was pretty fun, man. But I want to talk about this fight because there was something definitely wrong with this fight. And of course, I'm talking about Natasha Jonas versus Michaela Mayer. Now, I know maybe some of you guys don't like women's boxing or what have you, man. But I was interested in this fight. Um, I'm slowly starting. Well, not slowly. I've probably been paying more attention to women's boxing. Um, I started probably, I don't know, man, maybe about five years ago, four years ago. I'm not even really sure. But it is entertaining. Okay, it is entertaining. And I'm starting to uh, like it a little bit more and more. And this fight was a pretty good, damn good scrap. I liked it, Holmes. I liked it. I liked uh, the back and forth between uh, Natasha uh, Jonas and Michaela Mayer. Now, I picked Michaela Mayer to win this fight. And here's the thing. It went the distance, okay? In my opinion, Holmes... Michaela Mayer won most of the rounds. I think Natasha probably won about three rounds. That's it. Maybe just two. And, of course, the judges give it to Natasha Jones. All right. It was across the pond. You know, she's from over there. The home cooking, right? Michaela Mayer is uh, on this side of the pond. She travels over there, and they give it to Natasha Jonas. Again, if you guys know me, I rarely ever use the word robbery, right? I save the word robbery for a real, true robbery. Now, will I use it here? Hmm. I'm going to tell you guys this. If somebody calls it a robbery... I got zero argument with it. None at all. Will I call it a robbery? Um, no, but it's right on the borderline. It is right there. Michaela Mayer was landing many more cleaner punches. Many more. She was more in control of the fight round by round. Uh, Natasha did have her moments. And if it's a robbery, so be it. Again, I'm not going to argue with it. To me, I'm on, to me, it's going to be right on the borderline. I could wake up tomorrow and say it was a robbery, while right now I'm saying, mm, probably not a robbery yet. So I'm like right there. But damn, dog, you know, how can you do this, dog? How can this happen? Michaela Mayer went in there and put on a pretty damn good performance. And my opinion, won the fight. But look, it was a pretty fun fight. Like I said, it wasn't. I'm making it sound like it was one-sided. And it was one-sided because Michaela Mayer was winning the rounds. However... There were good moments in there for Natasha Jonas uh, for it to be like, okay, it's a fun fight. But nonetheless, uh, Michaela Mayer did win those rounds. But it was a fun one. I enjoyed it. Uh, I feel bad for Mayer because uh, she went in there and she fought her ass off, Holmes. And they gave it to, uh, you know, to Natasha Jonas, a little bit of home cooking. And. I'm not down with it, Holmes. And maybe now I'm convincing myself that maybe I should call it a robbery. Not sure yet. We'll see what happens. But damn, I feel bad for Michaela Mayer, man. I do. So, Cholo Trucker, those three chingones, boxing shots, all the chingones, each chingones. I'll catch you guys on next round.